let's talk about subtraction. Remember the five little monkeys that were jumping on the bed? So there were five of them, and then one of them fell out of the bed. So, how many monkeys were left jumping on the bed? Correct! There are now four little monkeys jumping on the bed. It is also the same as 5 minus 1 equals 4. Let us now discuss the parts of a subtraction sentence. The first number, which is 5, is called minuend. Everybody say, minuend. Minuend is the first number in subtraction. The second number, which is 1, we call this subtrahend. Everybody say, subtrahend. Subtrahend is the number that we take from the other number. Notice that the first letters in minuend and subtrahend form the word minus, which is the symbol in subtraction. Everybody say, minus. Our answer, which is 4, is called difference. Everybody say, difference. Difference is the answer in subtraction. Again, everybody say, minuend, subtrahend, minus, difference. And these are the parts of a subtraction sentence. So how do we do subtraction? How do we subtract a number from another number? Let's say we have this example, 7 minus 2. First, let us get the second number, which is 2. We will put the second number, which is also the smaller number, in our mind. And then, we will take it to the first number by counting from 2 to 7. Okay, let us count. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. How many numbers do I have? Okay, correct. 5, 7 minus 2 equals 5. Did you get it? Let's take another example. 9 minus 6. Again, let's get the second number. Put it in our mind, then count up to the first number. 6, 7, 8, 9. How many numbers do we have now? Okay. 3, 9, minus 6, equals 3. Did you understand? Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the Learning Corner channel. Till next time!